Gurjo works for a janitorial company in the Lower Mainland. He earns $10.25 per hour and earns a shift premium of $1.25 an hour when he works a night shift. Last month, Gurjot worked 120 hours. 40 of these hours were night shifts. What was Gurjot's gross income for the month? So a shift premium is a kind of almost like a, like a bonus wage for working undesirable shifts. So in this case, we're looking at night shifts as the undesirable shift. Could be, could be weekends or, uh, or whatnot. So in how a shift premium works is you take your regular wage... 10 25 an hour and you add the shift premium wage to it dollar 25 an hour and that is going to give you your hourly rate for those night shifts so you see here he gets a shift premium for night shifts so let's see what he makes on night shifts 1025 plus a dollar twenty-five is eleven fifty. So he's going to make eleven fifty an hour if he works a night shift. Otherwise, he only makes ten twenty-five an hour. Now we know that Gurjot worked one hundred and twenty hours. Forty of these were night shifts. So let's look at the forty hours there. We'll start with that. Forty hours times. Now for these forty hours, these are his night shifts. So forty hours here were night shifts. Okay, and on the night shifts, he gets his shift premium. So that rate will be $11.50 an hour. So for 40 of those hours, he gets $11.50 an hour. So $11.50 times the 40 gives us $460. So he gets $460 for those 40 hours of night shifts. But he worked 120 hours. So 120 is not equal to 40, which means he must have worked some shifts that were not night shifts or, or daytime shifts. So the remaining hours we're going to have to calculate here. We take 120 hours and we subtract off the 40 hours. We have 80 hours remaining. And we haven't calculated how much he gets paid for these 80 hours. Now he's going to get paid his regular wage for these 80 hours. So if I take these 80 hours and I multiply by the 1025, which is his regular wage per hour, let's see what we get. So 80 times 1025 is $820. So he gets $820 for his daytime shifts and he gets $460 for his night shifts. If we add these two amounts together, that is what he's getting paid for the 120 hours that he worked for this month. So what do we get? Let's take $460. And we're going to add that to $820 for a grand total of $1,280, which means that Gurjot's gross income for the month was $1,280.